nonverbal communication. That was big time. Wallace answers back. It's a 9-7 lead for Western Kentucky. Went for 29 on Saturday against ODU, and there's Jackson oh. falling away. How did he make that? Javon Jackson, a couple of possessions ago, he got the ball up in the high post, loses it, and then bounces back behind the line. First lead of the evening for UTSA at 17-15. Jackson, while you're up, go. fill her up again. <laughs> let it fly, young fella, let it fly. Flash it, and then this second one, the catch and shoot. This is a no-no. You better know where that guy is at all times. I have a biased opinion. Nokia in the game wearing 11. Jackson gets fouled Good shooting the night. three. Is there anything that he can't do? 61-56, Jackson has it. And it's poked away, but he might just put it up. Why not? Eight on the shot clock. Are you kidding me? Oh, he used the glass. He's just gonna be stuck in the basket. Dangerous entry pass, six on the shot clock. Watch the position, 23 and White's trying to get. High off the rim and it falls through for Josh Anderson. To Nicolau, thought about it. Here's Jackson, the reverse. Oh, Javon Jackson spins it in. Find him, there was guys passing up open shots or decent shots, but when they get And we're tied with 8.4 to go. Great Jackson. Oh, what a man. move. I Splits the defenders. He got whistled for the foul. Well, take a look at the play prior, though. Great help. Bassey kicked it back out. 10 on the shot clock. He got to space the floor a little bit. Savage again. Oh, he's hot. But it doesn't matter because of the change of direction. But then Jared Savage, the junior, key possession here. You don't want to get stopped. Wallace. Oh, oh, come on. Keaton Wallace uses the glass to cut the lead in half. I mean, they have to have a bucket here. Wallace throws up a three under duress. Somehow gets a delicate smooch off the glass. And again, you have to wonder if he called it. Second look, different angle, really good defense. Still casts it in. Amazing. Western Kentucky holds home court. 96-88 in overtime.